everybody, welcome to the next installment of the Mega Man 7 playthrough. Oh my god, finally made it to the Wily Fortress, and I know it's been taking like way too long for me to produce these things, but, you know, hopefully now that I've got a bit of a better schedule, I can do a little bit better. But, um, as you can see, we're hitting Wily's Fortress. Dum 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 I think this and the Mega Man 2 Wily Fortress... Uh, themes were used in more than, or the only or the only ones used in more than one game. Wow! But with this one, I just want to demonstrate a few different things. Um, for this and the rest of the uh, Mega Man 7 run, I'm actually using a new controller, and I decided, you know what? Why, what best way to give it a good run through than to just take it through the rest of Mega Man 7? Ow! Stupid birds! But um, as you can see, I've got all the way up here to Wily's Castle, and I don't need bolts, because uh, I pretty much bought everything I need. Um, either Well, I either found everything or bought everything else off-screen. I think the only thing I had left was the uh, rocket arm, which, eh, whatever. And even that, I think you can find somewhere in the stage. But uh, I don't like those platforms, so here's what I do. There you go. And I know these platforms, in typical Mega Man style, you have that floor there, but I say, fuck it, I'm just going to go and do that. I like flying. Whee! Uh, oh, and here's what these fours do. That noise is, noise is annoying. There we go. Lights on. Lights off. Lights on. Lights off. Yeah. That's what those particular panels do, and those platforms I passed up earlier do the same thing. Uh, and of course, if those platforms are spinning, you won't be able to stand on them, because Mega Man does not have magnets in his boots, which is kind of a good thing. Uh, so what I'm going to try and do and fail miserably is to try and get up there. I don't think I've ever managed to make it up there. I don't know why. But here's the Proto Shield. Just because. <laughs> I hardly ever... I, like, very hardly ever use it. Very hardly ever. Yeah, that's really good. Um, but I mostly stick to this when I need to just maneuver around. But, um... I, I mentioned earlier that I have a new controller for this, and in some instances it is going to show. In fact, a couple of the spots in this video are going to show pretty well how um, how how different it is. Um, it's what what the controller is is one of those um, uh, Nintendo 64 USB controllers, and um, the actual D-pad. While it works, don't get me wrong, if you try and push too many buttons at once, it'll only select like maybe two buttons to to, uh, obey. <laughs> um, like, two or three buttons to obey. And, um, you'll see it, you'll see it pop up a little bit more when I actually get to Dr. Wily. But you see a little bit in this video, too. Um, it only can do so many buttons at once. Whereas, with my old controller, I could charge up a shot, and I could slide at the same time in a certain direction. Oh, by the way, look, an E-Tank. But, do I really need an E-Tank at this point in the game? Oh, let's have a look. No, I don't. I'm full up on everything. <laughs> it's just... Oh, because, yeah, why not? Going to the Wily's Fortress. Oh, what's this? You are far too weak, Mega Man. Wily may fear you, but I do not. Oh, base. Uh, I don't know what... I don't know if you have balls or if you're just stupid. Because you should fear Mega Man. Everybody should fear Mega Man in his flying fist job attack. <laughs> uh, and that was over way too quickly, base. Round one goes to you, Mega Man, but I'll be back. Yes, I, um, I, I've, this is actually my second time recording the audio for this, <laughs> and last time I was just so inconsistent with Bass's voice, I'm like, no, 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 I can't have that. Meanwhile, cockroaches. Uh, yes, we are in Wily's basement. Bloop, bloop. And look at this, already at the boss. <laughs> that's that's kind of short. So, what, what what's in here? Let's find out. And boom! You know, it's been noted. It's been noted all over the place. Wily has a particular fetish for Gutsman. I don't know why. But to beat him, you, know, you can slap him in the face with a slash claw, or just slide into a block like I just did there. Don't do this. And I have no idea. I don't know how you can actually avoid that attack. I mean, I can... I'm looking at this now and thinking... Ow. I don't know why I slid into that either. See, that's another, one of those things. Just getting used to the controller. <laughs> and you guys get to go along for the ride. And watch me just have a rock fall on my head. Because that's fun, right? <laughs> oh, dear. 
but we get another shot, thankfully. So here we go, going right on in. Uh, here we go, yeah, 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 he's coming through. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah. So here he is, slap him in the face, and don't slide into him like I just did. <laughs> and as far as that move, I can, I can guess if you make it all the way over to the left, he can't get you. I don't know for sure. Um, I never really made it over there to give it a shot, and I obviously don't show it off in this video. Um, I know when Roll Mithril, I know right now as of this particular video, he's going through the uh, Mega Man Wily stages for his Perfect Run series. I can't wait to see what he does for this one, and, and how hard this one is going to be for him. But nevertheless, you flash him enough, you cut off his arm, and there you go. And I'm celebrating, I'm jumping around, yay! And I'm doing something most people do not recommend you do when you finish a Wily stage. But since this is a two-for-one, hey, look, power of editing takes me straight to the next stage. <laughs> now, normally what you would do is you would go back to the uh, Robot Master Select screen, and you can just reselect it or go to the shop or whatever, and all of your weapons would be refilled. Which is the case here, but I decided to cut out the middleman for this particular video. Because that first one, that was a little short. So, to make it things a little longer, make things a little more interesting, see, all, all, all full right there. <laughs> Including that Slash Claw that I totally drained. But, nevertheless, here we go. Wily Stage 2 is on the way. It's underway. And I'm just going to try and breeze through it as much as I can. And mess around with a new controller. Ah, shield attackers and sniper joes and and you know those turtles on the wall it makes me wonder. Maybe that has some significance. I don't know. We'll find out. And here I go and totally fail at, at how do I fail that hard in grabbing just a ladder, a simple ladder? You had one job, one job, and you failed. <laughs> but oh well. Yay, one up! Uh, okay. Yeah, that's real nice. Just, just fly uh, right, right up in front of the shot there, man. man. That, that's that's real good there. That's that's real good gameplay there, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Did I mention I love the jetpack? Oh, hey, this looks suspicious. I can't be at the boss already. No, nope, it's base. Ah, my wait is over. This time, the mighty Mega Man shall fall. Treble attack! <laughs> Yes, I I've got to give him that voice. Because I think Bass just... I think he got some of his personality from uh, Mega Man Powered Up style, the Lech Man. And naturally, he fuses fuses with with uh, Treble. I almost called him Bass. Bass fuses with Treble, damn it. Not, not with himself. And he gets this cool thing, and he gets his own Flying Fist Job attack. So maybe he does learn a thing or two from Mega Man. <laughs> Which, when I was growing up, and... and First time, first few times I played it, I used to have such problems with him. And just hit me in the back of the head, you asshole. Yeah, energy tank. Yeah, this is it. it it's hit the right button. How about that? Huh? Yeah. Okay. This is one of those times where I actually have to use an energy tank. Uh, mainly because I honestly I have not been to Mega Man 7 as often as I have with the other games. Which is why, like, some of my other gameplay videos, you can see me blast through them easily within, like, two or three videos. This one? <laughs> yeah. Why? Why can't I destroy him? I will kill him! Oh. So, yeah. That's done. And just for kicksies, just fly up here as high as I can and show just what those fan blades down there did, if, as if you didn't already notice. Uh, oh, this guy. Man, Wily loves that guy, apparently. And look, vertical scrolling area, conveyor belts, little froggies, and springs on the walls. This is gonna end well, isn't it? Uh, so, normally I don't have a problem, but this particular playthrough... <laughs> Boing. Yeah, that was a fail. And yes, springs can even knock you off of ladders. <laughs> oh dear. Whoop! Oh, and there we go again. And up we go. And to the ladder. Now this one, if you look at it just at just first time going through, you may think you have to take off the power armor and slide under that crack there. But no. You just whoop. There you go. I know that I thought that at first, but 
Oh well. And here we have those flame bars. Obviously, Wily maybe had a thing for Fireman as well. Okay, who else do you think designed Turbo Man's stage? Come on. <laughs> That, you know, that does lead me to wonder, do the Robot Masters design their own stages, or does Wily do it for them? Hmm. That, that's something I've never really thought of. I, I guess... I want to say it's a common theory that that the Robot Masters design their own stages, and then when Wily brings them to the fortress to steal some of their stuff, or what have you, or, or, or something like that, I'm not really sure. Eh, fuck that bad. I'm gonna get my revenge, but no. Haha, <laughs> you missed it. Now watch this. I'm gonna do this several times. I'm gonna fire off the wow. I'm gonna fire off my fist. And it's going to try and home in on some of that fire. Fire can't be damaged, but yet the thing will still home in on it. I want that energy, damn it. There we go. Ugh. See? It's weird like that. Oh, and look at this. Here we are at the boss. <laughs> and yes, those uh, things on the wall are meaningful. This boss is weak against Wild Coil! And it's a giant turtle. It's giant goddamn dragon turtle. Why dragon turtle? That's why. Oh dear. <laughs> that was close. Yeah. Well, I say it's too many buttons. I'm, I'm just gonna re re uh, correct myself from earlier and say certain buttons don't work properly. <laughs> yeah. And... I spend the most majority of this battle going to the pause screen to switch weapons instead of hitting L and R. I do it a couple of times. I do the L and R a couple of times, like that. But most of the time I'll just spend going to the pause screen. Ow! Yeah, I know you can get out of that by, I think by shaking, the, by, uh, not shaking, but, uh, hitting control pad or, or buttons or something to get out of it sooner, but in this particular run, I managed to fuck it up and never do it, so I take like six or seven units of damage because I just failed that much. And let's try getting the proper weapon. How about that? There we go. And just toss the strings in his face. I mean, I can, okay, I can understand how Shade Man's weakness can be Wild Coil because Coils can get all tangled up in his wings and, and send him crashing to the ground. Okay, I can get that. But how would that work here? I mean, would, would the turtle just like swallow the springs maybe? Or... Or, or something like that. Ow. Ah. Ah, I was gonna get that power up, but no! That was too much of a fancy. I probably could have gotten it, but oh well. And... Oh, wait. That was... Oh, that was horrible. That was horrible. And, and I will honestly say it was most likely the controller. I'm a little bit better than that. And, and yeah, well... You have your days. And I know some people in the comments are going to be like, Oh, excuses, excuses. No, really. <laughs> but, um... But I do make it through, so, you know. So, no matter what, I still overcome it somehow. And I even tested. I even tested the controller. But that's me going on too much about the controller at this point. When I should be just sitting there and slashing some goddamn turtles. See, now I, I learned. Oh, wait. What the hell am I doing? L and R. Duh. <laughs> uh, oh, you're not getting good. Oh, finally. Finally! You are dead, sir. You are dead to me, sir. Let's do the hop around of victory and waste all of our spring coils. Let's do it. Yay! <laughs> oh, yes. Life is good. And see, this is part of what I cut out earlier. But um, when we come back, we will hit the next Wily stage or two. And until next time, this is Gomer, the ranting thespian, signing off!